So, what's your deal? Okay, she's here. What's the plan? Kill her. Hey guys, this is Mylanda. Welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. We are starting with uh, chapter 3 today. Chapter 3, Monster or Mortal. Oh, we're gonna get to that D&D, aren't we? Oh, I am so looking forward to this. Ah, This is the life. Hey, Steph! Oh, awkward. Awkward for all. Okay. <laughs> you have a superpower? You're both fucking with me, right? Oh, damn. We let... We, oh, damn. Uh, nope. 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 Do Ryan and I look like the fucking with you type? It's all true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. <laughs> You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now. Whether it's true or not, you don't like being left out. Aw, that's probably true. Well, okay. Even I could tell you that. Oh shit, the foosball game. You knew exactly what to do. No shit. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Being around memories of Gabe was making you so sad. I wanted to help. You did. I'm just surprised. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. So, any sign of Diane today? Now we're gonna kick that no. bitch. But she was in yesterday, working on her laptop. You said she was afraid of something around Gabe's death. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. I hope so. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. We're on it. Oh. Time to earn a paycheck. I should clean the dirty dishes around the bar. Okay. Jogger. Can't go on a run. Everyone will see how awkward and out of shape I am. Forget it. Been dude. there before. Maybe I can encourage her. You should. I mean, like, dude, what the fuck? Who cares if other people are staring? They can go, you know. Maybe I can give her a pep talk using my extensive knowledge of running. Mmm. Appetizing. Cut down on the carbs and you're good. Uh, should I clean it? They should just talk to her first. Let's talk. Hey, can I ask you something? I've always felt too self-conscious to try running. You seem like a pro. Any tips? Oh. Well, definitely don't let that stop you. Just push through it, you know? I'll try that. Thanks. Damn! Trust me. You're not alone. Is she feeling better now? Is she feeling better now? Mmm. Appetizing. <laughs> okay. Clean that up. Is that Eleanor? How do these birdwashing contests even work? Who's checking the sightings? Stop. Nobody cheated. The people here respect the birders' code of honor as much as anyone. I just lost. Again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm I was so close. I just needed one more red-tailed hawk. There's always next year. Right? Yeah. I guess. 
Okay, these conversations are a little bit weird in like how much delay there there is be between each person talking. What? Time for your bath. Uh, yeah. That's. She's angry. Fuck you, Ryan Lucan. <laughs> Enjoy your Birder of the Year title while it lasts. Ooh, shit. Ryan's got a rival. Yeah, that's the reason why we're not helping her. We want Ryan to win. He needs a win. It just she just bounced on that table right there. No. Hey, welcome. I'll be right with you. Like never. I'm not done yet. I better check in with Steph and Ryan. Okay. Let's check out the notes first. Oh, we have Eleanor to look at as well. I no, 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 Beer taps? Ah, Colorado tap water. <clears throat> I'm not convinced this is totally sanitary, but what do I know? I mean, is everybody putting their grubby hands into it? Then yes, it's gross. Oh, I can play songs. Cool. Black Lantern will be closed on the last Thursday of every month. The town Council... Okay. Let's talk to Jed. Definitely the best boss I've ever had. Which, to be fair, isn't that high a bar. But Jed is great, to be honest. Did you trade out the quarters in the register yet? All you, kid. All right. Student. Where are you, girl from Rome? Gosh, I really miss that song. They used to play it in here all the time. Weird. I've never heard it. Maybe Jed knows where it went? Okay, I guess we're doing that. Hey, where do we keep unused jukebox CDs? We don't. Everything we have is in the jukebox. Cool. Just curious. All right, now we have to go find that song because we are awesome like that. Uh, I have no idea what that song is, though. Heart strings. Where's the girl from Rome? Where is it? Which one looks like looks like it has like a girl from Rome? <laughs> Shit. Can I is there a way for me to find out more about the song that she she wants to listen to? Where are you? Girl from Rome. I wonder what the song was. Maybe I can find out. Oh. Ha. Huh. F knows everything about songs. Hey, do you guys know a song that goes, Where are you, girl from Rome? Holy shit. Blast from the past. Alabaster Daydreams. My dad used to love that song. Gabe would put it on repeat just to mess with him. Got to the point where he couldn't stand to even hear it anymore. Okay. So... Okay. What happened to it? Oh, eventually Jed pulled it out of the jukebox oh. and stashed it somewhere. You could ask him. Oh, did he? Sweet. Oh, so they did take it out. Oh, son of a bitch. Come on. Hey, boss. Do the words alabaster daydreams mean anything to you? 
Oh, hell. Like brother, like sister, huh? Fine. Guess it's been long enough. It's back behind the bar someplace. Thanks. All right. We are doing our job. Oh, right there. Sorry, Jed. The people have spoken. All right. Shove it in. All right. Let's hear this infamous song. Where is it? Where did you where did you put it? 21? 22. Oh, there's more songs. Um Uh Elvis no, no, no. Where the hell is it? There we go. Enter. Earworm squasher. Joy. Alabaster daydreams. That's it. How the hell? Don't worry about it. <laughs> one small victory that no one will ever know about. That's what I'm here for. That's what heroes do. Yo, Eleanor. You know, the music a little bit, is a little bit too loud. I feel like I'm shouting over it. Okay. Sorry, music. You just have to go down here a little bit. I feel terrible for Eleanor and I don't think it's getting any easier if I can get help on my own Riley never needs to know about my condition I won't have to be a burden yes it breaks my heart that she's coping with this alone ah uh, you know maybe you should be a counselor talk to her hey Eleanor how are you I'm doing okay thank you dear I really appreciate your help from a couple weeks ago. It means a lot to me. Of course. I'm glad I could help. Couple of weeks. So it seems like it so it seems like it's been a while now. If I can get help okay. on my own, Riley never needs to know about my condition. I won't have to be a burden. I feel so bad for her. Steph and Ryan. The newest inductees. Gabe would be proud. Oh, did she? Did she out drink them all? <laughs> <sighs> Integrity to your to uh, to our very core. It's time to change your life. Join the ever-growing ranks of the world leader in excavation, mining, and distribution. Typhon Mining Company is hired is hiring both field and office position including team managers and directors we're looking to build relationships with our communities and that means giving you free long career opportunities that you won't find elsewhere anywhere else read that oh the hell am i gonna do with a jacket that says hell divers on the back <laughs> jeez i don't know boss man Maybe you could wear it, like the rest of us are going to do. You think I want to broadcast my affiliation with you jokers to the rest of the world? I got a reputation. <laughs> Jed's crew really loved him. No surprise there. Not to be a single issue voter or anything, but fuck Typhon. Yes. Got Ducky here. It's gonna be a long night tonight. Always is. Same thing every year. Oh. Tonight's the spring festival. I wonder what's wrong. Yeah, what's wrong? Poor Ducky. I wonder what's going on. Hey, Ducky. Is everything okay? Of course. I've never felt better. Okay. Glad to hear it. Hmm. It's going to be a long night tonight. Always is. 
Same thing every year. Jed acts like he's in charge, but we all know who really calls the shots in here. There's a dart on the bear's nose. Maybe we should remove it? Ooh, there's Charlotte. Ducky almost <coughs> hustled me out of my first paycheck. Good thing Jed stepped in. <laughs> Poor Amelia. Okay, read that. So, I started Dust in Daylight while you were at work. You're kidding. I already got to Verdant Cliffs. Wait. Holy shit, seriously? Yeah, I'm kind of addicted. It's a good game. I'm so glad you like it. Is this mobile games we're talking about? I really do. Oh, okay, cool. I'm not gonna do that. We gonna look? Charlotte must be getting ready for the LARP. Oh, is she? What is this? I wanna see, I wanna see, I can't see. Spells. I can't see that. Necromancy. Something. Musicians? Me, I, no. I don't know. Let's speak. Hey. Getting ready for the big LARP? Oh, hey. Yeah. Trying. I hope we can get Ethan into it. That's it. Is everything okay? Yeah. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll like it. Read her mind. Read her mind. Read her mi mind. Don't read her mind. Okay. Uh, before we talk to Diane, we're talking to our peeps. Steph and Ryan are waiting on me. I'll go check in. Just talk to Steph. I couldn't ask for a better Scooby squad. Okay, she's here. What's the plan? Kill her. Well, we have two plans, actually. But we're still workshopping them. Steal her laptop. Workshopping? Um, two is good. Good to have options, right? So what are they? Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, what? <laughs> and she's so into it. She doesn't notice one Ryan Lucan swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. Maybe Diane and I still hook up. Not important. <laughs> <laughs> That's your plan. Oh my god, please tell me you have something better. I do. And like Ryan goes to, to ask you it. It's the same plan. Except I'm the distraction. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, alright? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. All the transplants are. Damn it, now I have to go. <laughs> I kind of like the plan though. I think it's hilarious, but I don't, I'm not sure it's going to work. I think, I think Diane is not going to get easily distracted, especially with like the things going on now. Matt, let's keep workshopping. <laughs> okay, maybe these plans do need some more time. What? It's a simple plan, literally two steps. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. <laughs> okay, I'm not doing that. You're the only tiebreaker we have. <sighs> what? What? What are you talking? Okay, the harder distraction. I don't. I think this is a no-brainer. Steph is definitely the harder distraction, and I. Oh damn! Yes. Let's go with Steph. Badass DJ. It's a no-brainer. Sorry, Ryan. Fuck yes. In your face. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Uh, look, I appreciate the the effort, but we don't even know if she has anything worth stealing yet. 
I'm just going to try talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Good luck. That's Steph hooking up with the enemy. I'm not, I'm not. Thanks, Alex. <laughs> I'm not in on that. What's the best way to rile her up? Help me for Gabe's sake. Whoa. Wow. I know you're responsible. This sounds very accusational. Let's go for this. I don't think this will work though, but it seems less aggro, maybe? You know all I want is justice for my brother. Please. Help me. No, I don't think that's gonna work either. Alex, I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. We want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. That's the truth. Read her. Read her right now. Read her. She's got a great poker face, unlike Mac. But let's see what she's really feeling. Yes. Oh my god, I love this superpower. Let me try and read her first. Okay. Let's look at what we got here first. We got a little picture over there, which I cannot zoom because my eyes cannot zoom. We got um, those ty Typhon books. I want to take that external hard drive. Um, should have good stuff on it. Keys, swiping her keys, do nothing. Uh, maybe phone, maybe. But let's read her. Let's look at her first. I should try reading Diane's okay. emotions before we go any further. She is blue right now. Poor Gabe. No one deserves to die like that. She's sad. If I keep her thinking about Gabe's death, maybe I can find out more. That does nothing. Ask about... Napkins, really? Um, maybe. Uh, let's ask about the photo first. Oh, such a cute photo. My niece and nephew. They're adorable. Read her now. Poor Gabe. No one deserves to die like that. Uh, freaking napkins? Do you have, um, enough napkins for the table? Uh, yeah. I'm fine, thanks. Poor Gabe. No one deserves to die like that. Okay, maybe the cross will actually get me something, so we're leaving that till last. Oh! Shit, there's actually more stuff than I, than I thought. I mean, I could do... Oh. Black Lantern by Ethan... La okay. Ask about it. Are you joining in the LARP later? It's been so hard for Ethan. We're all hoping it will cheer him up. I can't. Good luck, though. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. He was practically a father to Ethan. And now he's gone. It's just so fucked up. Ah, at least we got something from that. Uh, we've seen that. Ask about this. Typhon does a lot of local hiring, huh? We're always growing. He was practically a father okay. to Ethan. And now he's gone. Nothing there. It's just so fucked up. I bet you and Gabe threw back a lot of these together. He was a great bartender. Made the long work days more bearable. Okay, okay, this one, this one's good. A month later, and I can still feel the void he left behind. William Bloom. Gabe loved him. I think he spent a whole year just listening to him. <laughs> really? He had good taste. Surprised we never talked about it. Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. Of all the people this could have happened to, why'd it have to be him? I want to ask about the cross as well. That's a nice cross. Oh, thanks. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it, that does nothing. Of all the people this could have happened to, why'd it have to be him?
Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Alex, I... We... Typhon is doing everything we can to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? Beat her now. All right. That's the emotion I was looking for. Time to explore Diane's guilt about Gabe. Okay, here we go. Keyboard just turned blue and green. Okay. Time to find out what Diane is really hiding. Okay, we got we got two things to look at. Typhon. He came here looking for a better life, just like me. He's gone. I'm still here. Hello? Miss Jacobs? It's Deputy Pike. Pike, I'm sorry, but we're very busy at the moment. There's been an accident. What kind of accident? Wait, there's something else. I can't undo what Typhon did, or the role I played, <gasps> but at least I have everything I need to protect myself from them. Holy shit. She must have evidence on the USB stick. Oh, looks like I'll need a distraction after all. Go, Steph! <laughs> I mean, Steph is definitely the harder distraction. Until I see this, oh my god. Ah. Oh damn. <laughs> hey Diane. Oh. Hey Steph. How are you? So what's your deal? I'm sorry. Are you single? <laughs> Semi single? <laughs> Taken, but still down to get drunk and make out? Whoa, <laughs> was not expecting that <laughs> at all. Um, am I blushing? I feel like I'm blushing. You should be. <laughs> no, 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 you're cool as a cucumber. <laughs> That's good. I'm so flattered. I don't even know what to say. Hey, no, no sweat. Just think about it. Get back to me. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> oh, Diane. She got so confused. She's so confused. Look at her. Uh, that was weird. <laughs> 